good morning it is tuesday it's coming up to 11 o'clock and i'm only just going to have some breakfast it's been a busy busy day but I did something yesterday, oh, do you know what? I'm so impulsive, my personality is so, so impulsive. Honestly, it's my mum, I'm really bad, but I think I get it from my mum and the children get it from me as well, like, especially Katie-Anne. But let's start off with my face because I ended up having, it looks really, really, it looks, it's worse in real life, guys. I ended up having an allergic reaction to some under eye masks. So yesterday morning, I said to the girls, like, we'll have a little pamper day because it was the last day back at, um, the last day at her, the, the last day of half term and they're back at school today. I said, let's have a nice little pamper day. Um, I did all the ironing, got all the house done. And then I put an under eye mask on, literally just put it there. And I was like pushing it back and forward to try and get it to sit. And then, wow, the stinging sensation. Like I was like, wow, like that is, that is strong. So I took it off and then I just tried to like dab the solution around my eyes instead. <laughs> Bad move, look at it. I didn't quite get as far as putting it on this eye, um, but it is really bad. It's really bad. Um, it's literally burnt my eye, so not fun. Um, but in other news, <laughs> uh, so last night I booked a holiday. I booked a holiday for me and the girls. Oh, you've gone blurry then. For me and the girls, um, for four days in the Easter holiday to Tenerife. I am so excited. Now, I've been saying for years I wanted to take the kids on holiday, like a girl's holiday, regardless of the whole like mess situation or whatever. Um, I've always wanted to do that. And at the beginning of the year, I wrote my bucket list down for this year. And well, not my bucket list, like things I wanted to do this year. And one of them was to go on a girl's holiday and I booked it. I didn't go all inclusive. I've just done breakfast because I want to explore. So we're there for four days. I don't want to be like stuck in the hotel. So I booked, it's cheap and cheerful. Um, there's a pool there, but we are so close to the beach, literally like five minute walk to the beach, a 10 minute walk to town. Um, I found a museum that is 10 minutes like walk a sushi restaurant and I just think it's gonna be such such a lovely like girls holiday so I'm so excited about that I told them and they're like oh my god um yeah so we are going to Tenerife in four weeks which is a very exciting like I say I'm very impulsive and I was just like I'm gonna book it I'm gonna book it so I did I booked it um, so that's something to look forward to. So I'm also going to start today a four week soft challenge. So I started the 75 soft challenge at the beginning of the year. Obviously shit hit the fan and I, it literally, it didn't last long. Um, and it's basically, well, depending on however many days you want to do it. I mean, you can adjust it to whatever you want. So I'm going to do it for four weeks because it's just over four, four and a half weeks till we go on holiday. And it's basically setting intentions, setting routine, um, and basically keeping yourself accountable. So mine is going to be, um, working out every day for 30 minutes. That can literally be like going for a half an hour walk, staying in my deficit, um, reading every night, reading a chapter, you already know I'm on my fourth book, um, journaling every day, which I've, I'm still doing, I love it, I love doing the journal, the five minute journal is like spot on, because you don't need to be there for hours, um, like writing loads of jargon, you know what I mean, when you're just writing gibberish for no reason, it's literally two minutes in the morning, three minutes at night, so yeah, that is, that's what's been happening. It's a busy week this week. Last night, and I didn't go to bed till about half past 12 at night because her chief fell out. Um, so she's gonna be so tired tonight. So I might just do like, honestly, nugget and chips for dinner and have an early night because I am tired, really tired. 
um, and then she has got I've got my driving lesson tomorrow she's got rainbows on Thursday after school she's so excited for that um, I bought the rainbows uniform like 80 odd quid Wow, so expensive um, but I couldn't find any second hand obviously that's my first protocol vinted um, couldn't find any second hand and then she's got her Valentine's disco on Thursday which I'm helping out for and then on Friday we've got a Paddington like crafting like engagement morning as well so it's a busy week and then Saturday she's actually doing her first badge it's like a mindful thinking badge thing I think um so she's at Rainbows on Saturday from half past nine till three I think so you know I'm going to the gym I haven't been to the gym in over two weeks it has pissed me right off oh keep going blurry um so yeah, I'm gonna go and have my breakfast. I did, I was on it for prepping for the four week soft challenge. I mean, I say soft because there's a hard one where you, where you have to like do two workouts a day, you don't have a rest day and all this kind of crap. Um, but I prepped some overnight oats. So these have got 40 grams of protein chocolate oats, um, some Biscoff on there and then um yeah you can see this one a bit better and then some frozen berries i might have this one today it looks bigger i'm starving <laughs> such a fatty and i also bought these actually for a nice little dessert because i'm not about like cutting out food or f like food is bad but i brought these little um chocolate pots they are 100 calories, I think. Yeah, little chocolate pots, 100 calories. I thought they'd be nice with some strawberries. And the date on them is the 28th of July. So they're going to last ages. But yeah, I'm going to go have my breakfast. And I will probably see you now tomorrow, actually. Hopefully my eye um, clears up a bit. It is raining. It is pouring it down <laughs> and I'm just going to the bus stop because it is Valentine's Disco and I'm setting up PTFA so I'm helping setting up and then I'm going to stay for the two discos so they have early years, key stage one and then key stage two so Nyla will have two discos and then it's busy tonight so we've then got, I'm um, going to have some dinner quickly in um, Weatherspoons, which is literally across the road from the school and then she's got a rainbow she's really excited to wear her uniform this week um but yeah why is it raining um logged off for work went in the gym didn't want to go to the gym but i did after three weeks um and i'm just ready for bed now time for rainbows i am so happy it's friday so happy it's friday i'm freezing <laughs> i'm so tired i don't know if i said is it in have i said it this week or was it last week i'm staying up silly o'clock reading and then getting up for work and school and stuff and i'm just white um and now i've been reading for a little bit not as much as i would normally read but then my brain my brain won't switch off at the minute like i've just got so much stuff going on in my head it's like please would you just go to bed go to sleep but it's friday pizza friday on my own <laughs> we was having pizza on a thursday now is that my phone pinging ping 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 um what's i saying now can't remember yeah like i'm i'm just so tired but i'm glad it's friday oh yeah pizza so we was having pizza on a thursday i don't know if my phone's blurring up or if it's because it's um on its way out or if it's warm in here because i've got pizza on i've got sweet corn on i'm having pizza for pizza friday i'm having pizza friday to myself kids are with mares they've got mcdonald's um we was doing pizza on a thursday but now Nyla goes brownie, uh, rainbows, <laughs> I keep saying brownies, um, we ended up at Weatherspoons for dinner yesterday, but I don't know, I don't know, we still might do 
pizza on a Thursday. I don't know, but it's Friday. I've got pizza in the air fryer, which is nearly done, and I'm oh, I cannot wait for that. Been the gym, went in the gym, um, came home, and literally had got home at twelve literally had half an hour to eat some porridge so i did protein porridge just to fill me up um i haven't done like a what i eat in a day for ages but i am using this one which is delicious it's the chocolate um protein 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 porridge and i do 50 grams of that make it with water and then i've been putting 100 grams of blueberries in and then topping it with biscoff it's so good i've got a code um pw kira to get 40 percent off of protein world honestly i love that that's the only protein porridge i will eat all the others i'm like they literally taste rank um and then i had to go to parent engagement day so they're learning about paddington um and we did paddington bears it was honestly <laughs> so cute look at them they are so so cute um, i love the parent engagement little sessions um and then we went into sainsbury's because i've seen these all over social media and i found them this was the last packet the last packet so it's the trek power biscoff protein bars these were flipping expensive three pounds 75 these were for three but i just wanted to try them so i'm gonna have one of them later with a cup of tea i'm gonna have my dinner now in peace um can of coke and i'm gonna watch um teen mum i'm back in my teen mum era there's no way i can go back to that good morning it is early um we got up at seven so nyla she's eating her breakfast she's ready for rainbows she's using her little table that she made for her breakfast in the mornings she's got her milk just packed her lunch because you're going to thinking day aren't you yeah thinking day so she is doing her thinking badge today i don't know if i said it yesterday to be honest just gonna make my drink for the gym back on my jelly belly <laughs> is it jelly belly yeah jelly belly and um, clear way love this stuff i didn't show these yesterday what did i i don't know um the new trek bar biscoff protein bars nah <laughs> Unfortunately, I won't be buying them again because they are just, they're not it. But Nyla is at Rainbows today from half nine till three. She's doing her thinking day badge. Um, and I'm going to go spin. I'm like a whole day. Because yesterday, obviously, was my day off. I went to the gym and then had to kind of come home quickly and then go to the school. So I didn't really have a day to just to, to recuperate you know what it's like um so i'm gonna go i'm gonna go spin i haven't been able to go spin for so long but i can get her dropped off and then go to spin and then we will get the bus home um but yeah where is my car is she still in bed she was gonna go to her friend's house but i'm not too sure I'm going to wake her up and just be like, do you want to go? If you don't, then I'll just leave you asleep and it's fine. And then I'm going to go to Kay's, going to grab some lunch, go to Kay's and chill out with Kay for a bit. But I didn't enjoy getting up early on a Saturday, not going to lie. We're going to have a lazy morning tomorrow, breakfast in bed or with a film because we normally do that on a Saturday. Um, but yeah, she's got enough food. You know when you worry when your kids are somewhere all day and they haven't got enough food so i've made sure she's got enough food they've got like biscuits and juice and stuff there anyway but i'm just gonna do my clear way and then get ready what a sunday Honest to God, it is 10 to 2, just waiting for a taxi because we go into the cinema to watch Wonka, but I have spent all day doing laundry. It has been either putting the clothes away, doing the washing, drying, getting the clothes off the radiators, it's just been clothes, clothes, clothes. 
I don't know the last time I did laundry. Like, I, I can't think. I've done none on weekend. On Fridays, I normally do like quite a load of washing. Um, quite a load. Does that make sense? Quite a load. Quite a lot. Yesterday, um, because Nyla was at Rainbows all day, I ended up. Did I speak to you yesterday? Did I speak to you yesterday? Um, I don't even know. These last few days have just like, um, yeah, she was at Rainbows doing her thinking badge and I ended up going spin and then going to K's and then getting a taxi from K's, which was expensive, to brow to Rainbows. I keep saying bloody brownies. To Rainbows. And then we got the bus home. Yeah. I, so Saturday I kind of lost because I couldn't do any housework or laundry or anything. I've done four loads of washing. The fifth load is in the washing machine. I hope it doesn't bloody break. I don't think I've ever done that much washing in a day. Even when we've gone on holiday. Um, so yeah, we didn't even have we didn't have breakfast in bed, we didn't have a movie in bed. Um, but we are gonna go watch Wonka, so just waiting for a taxi, um, and then Guess what we're doing after Wonka? Are you trying to cut it off? The Alpha. We're gonna go out for dinner with Daddy. Where to? We're gonna go to the carvery. You know where you pick your own meat and your mash? Yeah. And you and love Rosie. Can I show them my trick? Show them your trick quickly and then we'll get our shoes on. She's learned. I think, have you not showed them this week? No, we haven't. So this is the trick. Cora away. Cora's fine. <laughs> <laughs> that was not your trick. I can see yeah. your backside. Do you want to try it again? Let's just do it. Oh. Just do it. You can do it better on your bed, can't you? Woo! Sassy girl! <clears throat> right, yeah, let's get shoes on and go watch Wonka! Have I got enough food? No, you have not. <laughs> we are home, we are showered, we are going to chill out now, it is five past seven and um, I am going to read, I'm going to read my book, this is the one I'm on at the minute, I am just loving reading, <coughs> only annoying thing, I'm, I'm really um, greasy at the minute because it's retinol day, so last week if you didn't watch i am on a retinol journey now so um you use it once a week if it all focus this is the one i'm using anyway the one from inky list um so you use it once a week i don't know if it's going to focus there you go once a week and then three times a week and then you can kind of use it pretty much every day so that's why I look greasy because I do like I layer it up because you can um, end up purging with it so I've looked into retinol 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 <laughs> um, and you can purge so you can like get flaky skin or you can break out loads with spots so I will spritz my face with rose water then put a light moisturizer on then retinol and then a thicker moisturizer and you can and it's it's called like layering um so that's why my last layer is really thick but my eye it's fine now it's not reacting to anything I can use my normal cream and stuff but yeah went off on a tangent then that's why I look like an actual shiny a shiny mess but yeah I forgot to charge my light so it's looking brighter than it is um, on camera but I don't know how long that's gonna last and normally I'll just chill here with my salt lamp on I always sleep with my blind with my blinds open never close my blinds fun fact about me the only time I will close them is in the summer but um, in the winter and autumn and that I keep them open um, I might leave my door open. Can I see with my door open? Let's test it. Mm, might be able to. But yeah, like I said, I, well, I don't know if I said that. I've just been on a bit of a wobble. 
um, waffling tonight, I do apologise for this clip. Um, I would normally edit the weekly vlog while Nile is in the bath on a Sunday, but we didn't get back till half six. We just had quick showers. Um, I didn't need a hair wash. Bless you, didn't need a hair wash. Nyla always has a hair wash on a Sunday, but um, she didn't take too long. She's in her room for half an hour. Um, so yeah, I didn't have time to edit, and I could edit now, but I don't want to. I want to sit in my bed and read, so I will edit tomorrow night, I think. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed the weekly vlog. Um, I am going to look at some bits for holiday um just like sun cream and stuff like face sun cream there's only a few now that i use like specifically use i won't try any other sun creams especially face sun cream so what i'll do is because i wrote a couple of blog posts about it last year i'll leave it in the description box in case you were ever wondering about like oh what sun cream should i use and stuff so i also need to take my prescription sunglasses to spec savers to change the lens on them um, but yeah, I'm going to go do some reading and I will see you next week.